Use the MIDI to After Effects app to bring MIDI data into After Effects. You can now use notes and sliders used in the MIDI music performance to control any attribute in After Effects. There are only two steps. First, drag and drop your MIDI file into the MIDI to After Effects app. Second, import the output into After Effects and start controlling your shapes. Let's start by recording a sample snippet. We have a few notes, a few chords, and some control change. I'll export this both as a MIDI file and as an audio file. Now let's drop the MIDI file into the MIDI to After Effects web app. I get this file back, which I import into my After Effects comp. Here's what I have in my comp. Four circles. I want them to change size when I play A, B, C, and D. I also have this text box, which I want to use to display the names of chords I played. And then lastly, I have the rectangle. I want it to scale out when I sweep the MIDI control change. To do all this, all I need to do is pick whip the data in the MIDI to After Effects file to the proper attribute. Let's start with the circles. I pick whip the scale of the first circle to the key of A, which means that now the circle size will change depending on how hard I press A. I repeat the same thing for the other circles and the keys B, C, and D. Next, I pick whip the text source to the chord name data. And lastly, I pick whip the scale of the rectangle to the MIDI control change. Now, I can also import the audio file that we exported earlier, which matches the MIDI file. We press play, and here's the result. We now have an animation that reacts to MIDI data with matching audio. I would love to see what people come up with at the intersection of music recording and motion graphics. Thanks for watching.